it's a long story that I'll get into some other time, but in 2015, I lost my faith. I actually, I hate that phrase. I didn't lose it. That sounds like an accident. Uh, I, I know exactly where I put it down at. Um, but the same year, I lost my job. I, I worked at a church, so those two things might have been related. For about five years after that, I felt lost. Um, inside the Christian church, um, I had a job, I had a community, I had a worldview, I had a purpose. And um, I really struggled to find those things outside of my faith. In early 2020, at the beginning of the pandemic, I became obsessed for some reason with the idea of the daemon. Uh, the daemon is a Greek concept of a guiding spirit. Uh, Socrates talks a lot about having a daemon, uh, a spirit that would accompany him and help him make decisions and guide him throughout his life. And that's what I found myself kind of wanting, a, a supernatural compass that would help me know which direction to go. Uh, arguably, uh, when I was a Christian, I had that in the form of the Holy Spirit, right? I wanted something like that again. So I started studying the idea of the daemon. Was it just a Greek mythological concept? Uh, well, well, no. Other cultures and other religions have something kind of like it. Uh, there's something like it in Kabbalah. There's something like it in Sufism. Uh, the Egyptians believed in something like it. But was there something to all of that? Was there something for me as a, as a Western man in 2021 in um, supposedly a uh, rationalistic culture with a rationalistic worldview? Was there something to this concept? I believe there was, and I believe it's found um, most readily and explained most readily in Carl Jung's concept of the self. I'm 48 years old. Uh, I'm a husband and uh, a father. Um, I say that to say I'm not some 20-year-old Jordan Peterson fan. No offense to 20-year-old Jordan Peterson fans, but um, I'm I'm in midlife. Um, if uh, if there is a, a diamond, if there is truth to the idea of the guiding self, um, I'm ready for it. I I need it now. Um, and um, from what I can tell, there is truth to it. Um, I believe yourself exists. I believe your daimon exists. And you can make contact with it through things like dream interpretation and inner work. And even in some, in some ways divination um, uh, and those kinds of things. And um, that's what this vlog is about. This vlog is about um, making contact with your true inner self, the part of you that exists outside of space and time and that is drawing you to itself, that wants to manifest but needs you to manifest. Um, and so um, that's what we're going to talk about. And along the way, we'll touch on things uh, like the I Ching and the bicameral mind and even Jesus and uh, Philip K. Dick. So um, we're, we're going to cover a lot of ground in this exploration. So uh, welcome. Let's get going.